the creative spark of an Australian researcher is about to transform steel making. New green technology that turns waste plastic and rubber into steel will soon appear on the world market. One Steel has signed a global deal with Sydney's University of New South Wales to sub-license the technology. The process is the brainchild of Professor Veena Sahajwala. Well, what we have done is we've actually created the ability to recycle waste plastics and waste rubber for making steel. In the process itself, we've actually shown that the steel making process can in fact become more energy efficient. So we've lowered our electricity consumption. So it's win-win from both recycling waste materials as well as from energy consumption that's used in the steel making process. It was just such an exciting opportunity with the environmental issues that were there. Originally this project was all about environment. What can we do to get rid of landfill? Then once we started doing the trials, we saw that it was a major improvement to our productivity and led to a reduction in our electrical energy and our cost. Items such as shopping bags, takeaway containers and plastic drink bottles are reduced to granulated plastic. These granules are then injected into the furnace. This process accesses carbon, an essential element in electric arc furnace still making. The process has the added benefit of holding in heat, which ultimately lowers the cost of steel making. What a researcher feels when you've actually gone off and, you know, come up with an idea, trialled it, tested it, proven all the theories and everything works beautifully in the lab and that's a big amazing achievement, you know. But then the ultimate icing on the cake is when you've got, you know, an industry that is so keen to take it on board and is as excited as you are to in fact implement it and to make it happen. That's, that's been amazing. Steelmakers are looking to reduce their cost and improve their productivity. And this is one way they can do it, which is environmentally friendly. It is a no-brainer.